Hey guys, it's Naz again. Just a quick update on a, a previous video I made about the Astro A50s for the game and voice options mixing settings. People are getting confused on how to set this up on the PC. I'm only going to show the PC because that's what I, I game on, that's my only platform. But I'll uh, show you how to do this correctly because people are, are getting this um, a wrong idea on how to set this. Uh, first of all, I just want to say make sure on your actual um, base station there's a switch on the right hand side where the USB port is. Make sure that is set to PC, not to PS4 if you've got the black and blue version. If you've got the grey and green version, that's the Xbox edition, make sure it's not switched to the Xbox, it's switched to PC. Second thing is don't use the optical cable because it will cause you more problems and more issues and you won't get the full surround sound what the headset offers, the Dolby surround sound. Make sure you use the USB cable that comes with it, connect that into your computer and that just connect that only. Uh, once you've done that, uh, it should uh, your Windows should pick it up automatically, install the drivers. Uh, if you're having problems uh, with this options I'm going to give you how to set it up, try another USB port like a U the USB 3.0 port or another port and then restart your PC and do the same thing. Uh, the other options as well, you can reset your headset. Um, the headset, how you reset your headset is you hold down the game button and the uh, Adobe Digital button for 10 seconds. Your d uh, base station will blink, it will turn off and it'll come back on and then you switch on your headset. Obviously it, it'll be on when you do this reset. You put it back onto the base station to resync it. That will hopefully reduce you know, more problems, fix the problems. The other thing what you need to do as well, make sure you're up to date with the firmware for the headset and the base station. Uh, as you can see here, it's like a 24327.42 for the headset firmware. Base station is 24246.42. Uh, so it's almost the same, so make sure you update those. So when download the Astro uh, Command Center, uh, you don't need to click anywhere here and it should automatically update your headset. Make sure you update your headset as well, that helps with some of the issues and with the microphone quality as well. So let's let's do this. It's the same thing as my previous video. Type in sound on your um, desktop, you know, in your search bar section. It will show up as this option here. Um, for me, you can see there's only three options here. I can show you my disabled devices. You can see in my um, monitor over here showing that which has got built-in speakers and my motherboard uh, digital output, which is obviously the fiber optical cables. Uh, I'm not going to show this for now. You should see two options where your headset. Obviously here you've got my desktop speakers. Uh, I'll show you how you can swap between the two uh, when you're not using your headset at the end of this video. Um, these are the two options that you should have. One will be headphones, one will be headset earphones. The headphones will say game, the earphones will say voice. You need to set this either two ways. One, either you can right click and you'll have the option that says set it as whatever, but obviously here it says set as communication device, we don't want that, we're going to set that as default. You have to set Astro Game as default, otherwise this won't work when you're having your chat and your game, because your games will mostly work on your default uh, headphones audio selection. Some games don't pick that up. You have to set that in the actual game in order for this to work as well. So what you need to do one way is just to just click this little arrow. Don't click set, just set de default. It'll set it both as default. Click set, set as default device. Your headset earphone, go again on the drop down, click def default communication device. Once you've done that, go to your recording. I'll show you my disabled devices again. You can see my um, webcam here and uh, my motherboard settings. Obviously, you don't want to show you that. You should see two more settings again. Line in. Line in is for um, the, the connection you can make with uh, your phone uh, and listen to music and take calls. Uh, this works through the 3.5 jack on the back of the base station, so you can hook that up. Uh, for now, we don't want to touch that. What we need to go to is a he headset microphone, and you know, same thing again. Set as default. So you click there. That'll set a default for all your uh, recording. Then click OK. You're done there. Right. I'm going to show you three options here. The one is going to be for Teamspeak, uh, Discord, and Skype. So Teamspeak. What we're going to do here is go Tools, Options, and then in your playback. 
what you need to do is just playback device you need to select it might be set on default what you need to do you can't keep it on default because it will go to the game so whenever you adjust your vo volume it will change with the same with the game so this you need to change you need to go down to headset earphone voice you got to remember this is for the voice so any program that you have to do with voice has to be set on the voice channel so don't set it as headphones because remember this is for your game that's why it says game there always set that as voice same thing with the capture obviously your microphone has to be set up be set up with your not line in because that will be your phone audios you know th that's the line in you need to set that as headphone voice again click that click ok now your team speaker will work no problem next up we'll go to discord same thing here what you do you go down to this uh, user settings bracket click on that click down on voice this is app app settings your input device will probably be on default these both will be on default your input device should be headset microphone as so obviously we'll be talking with the output this again same time do not click game click on voice you should see astro a50 voice once you've done that, if once they're both on voice, this program will work with your headset and your games. Same thing with Skype. Skype, you go to Tools, Options, and then you go down to Audio Settings. These will probably be set defaults as well, but normally Skype is smart enough to pick this up. Uh, so mine, obviously, again, you set to voice for the microphone, for the speakers, you set the same thing as voice. You don't set it as headphones where your game audio goes through or your speakers, you set that click save and you're done there those are three programs now they should work um, if it this this doesn't work um, I don't know what else I can show you but this is how it's done I am going to show you a small trick where sometimes I don't use my headset so what I normally do is if you the easiest way to change your audio from your desktop speakers to your headphones is go down to the bottom corner in the you see the little icon of your speakers if you click that you have a pop-up that turns up it will say normally you sit if you got your headset set as default obviously here we've got it set default so headphones astro a50 game if you click that it'll bring up some more options obviously i disabled my speakers on my monitor because they're terrible but i do have desktop speakers so what you can do here is if you scroll down and click speakers this will actually set your desktop speakers as default device so you can listen to movies or whatever music you want without your headphones but remember when you go back into your games and you go back into your team speakers of that make sure you hit the astro a50 game again so hopefully this will help you guys out um, if you have any questions just let me know in the comments and um, i'll get back to you as soon as i can but hopefully this should clear all the problems that we're having thanks very much goodbye